Hey guys, what's going on? When it comes to editing GoPro Hero 9 Black 5K footage, it can be a huge strain on your computer. It probably looks like this when you're trying to scrub around the through the timeline. It's stutter central. In fact, in a lot of cases, you're going absolutely nowhere. So in the next couple of minutes, I'm gonna show you how you can fix that really, really easily. My name is Vic Barry and this YouTube channel is going to give you techniques, tips and thoughts for all things video. So please consider hitting subscribe, especially if you find this video useful. Right now I'm in Adobe Premiere Pro and as you've seen it's an absolute nightmare. It's a slideshow is what we're getting when we're trying to edit 5k footage. Now this works on any computer no matter how old it is and the idea is kind of the same across lots of different software that allows you to do proxies and that's the magic sauce. So let's create a proxy from this really easy. First thing we got to do is right click on our clip that we want to make a proxy of. Go down to create proxies. Let's click this. And in my case, I use a QuickTime ProRes proxy, which is really efficient and just runs like butter. So let's make this one. I'm going to select OK. And we have two options here as well, by the way, next to the original media in the proxy folder, or you can dump it wherever you want. I generally stick to kind of keeping it on the first option here. So it's all in the one place where your video is. And then all you got to do basically is press OK. Pressing OK opens up Adobe Media Encoder and basically what this does is it's going to create this low resolution proxy which in turn allows you to edit the whole thing very, very quickly, very efficiently and very, very smoothly. Wait, you guys see this in a second, it's insanely good. Once the proxy is complete, let's jump back into Premiere Pro and then there's one or two steps that you got to take before you can really start editing this stuff like butter. Let's go. I'm back in Premiere Pro. I'm just going to grab this clip here and drag it onto the timeline. So as you can see, it's still a slideshow. So what we need to do is turn on the proxy option. So once I hit this button here, toggle proxies, look at this. Look at the difference this has made. And I'm scrubbing back and forth here like... Oh, crazy, it's so good. So if you don't have this button here, what you gotta do is select the button editor, select plus, and then you gotta drag it on. So I'm gonna delete my one here, and now I'm gonna drag it back on so you guys can see exactly how to do this. Let's drag, simple as, that's it. That's all you gotta do, you just drag it on, and then select okay, and you're good to go so you can turn proxies on. Our office, yeah, let's leave them on. One little tip is that when you're about to render, just make sure you turn off the proxies to make sure they're completely off just before you render. So that's the kind of the big tip that you got to do at the very end. Now that's how you edit 5K GoPro Hero 9 black footage. And it's, look, mm, it's just... It's just so good. Speaking of good, there's a video here that I think you guys will absolutely love when it comes to the GoPro Hero 9 Black. And I'll see you on the next video. And if you found this one useful, please consider hitting subscribe. Oh yeah, don't stop fighting. I, I screwed it up. I knew that would happen.